Hey everybody, Scott Spritzer here at DocSports.com. Welcome to the update for Friday, May 15, 2020. It's Korean baseball that we're going to be talking about in this report. Free pick coming up for Friday morning's action in just a moment. If you've yet to become a member at DocSports.com, just want to give it a trial run, click on that link below the video and get set up for a free $60 account, which you can use on any of my daily picks or anybody else for that matter over at DocSports.com. A lot going on this weekend. Going to tell you quickly about it, then we'll get to the KBO. As far as we are concerned, you know about my KBO picks. They're up and available every day, 3.30 p.m. Eastern, 12.30 p.m. Pacific for the next morning's games. That includes Taiwan baseball. As far as soccer is concerned, my next picks will be posted Friday, 11.30 a.m. Eastern, 8.30 a.m. Pacific for Saturday's early games, and there's a bunch of them. Very excited that we got German Bundesliga soccer back in action. Join us along with Belarus soccer, which we've been involved with for about a month now. And uh, so we're excited. We're going to have a big weekend. We've got a seven-star play going this weekend in soccer action. And again, my early Saturday plays will be available Friday morning, 11.30 a.m. Eastern. You already know about UFC going Saturday night. You know about NASCAR on Sunday. Uh, my NASCAR picks will be available Sunday morning, 11.30 a.m. Eastern, 8.30 a.m. Pacific. And my UFC picks will be available Saturday morning at that same time, 11.30 a.m. Eastern. 8.30 a.m. Pacific. Number one over the last 24 years, my little circle with NASCAR betting. You don't want to miss out as we get back on track uh, with the season resuming. We're on runs of 17 and 5 and 24 and 8 in NASCAR before the lockdown. So we're excited to get back into NASCAR. And of course, the UFC, well, we're one and one since the UFC came back. We hit a six-star play on Nganu by knockout on Saturday. I lost a split decision on uh, Wednesday night with O. SP. Unfortunately, he lost that split decision. We didn't get the job done. That was our only play on a Wednesday night. We are in action on Saturday's card and uh, wanted to mention that. So be sure to jump on board. As far as baseball in last night's video, I apologize for not getting you a Thursday morning play uh, for about the upteenth time. We had internet service problems in our neck of the woods uh, with everybody being home, shut down, locked down, what have you. We're seeing some problems with internet service from time to time, being overwhelmed. And uh, we just had nothing uh, to do that we could do about it, unfortunately. And by the time we were able to get internet service again, it was close to game time Thursday morning. So uh, as far as Thursday morning's plays, we did turn a profit. Uh, we lost a small bet in with an over uh, in Korean baseball on Thursday morning. We won the big bet, which was China Trust, which was about a dollar ten dog uh, in, in Taiwan baseball, CPBL. One thing to notice about that league, I think they're just getting sharp action, and that's it in Taiwan. China Trust opponents, Fubon, for Thursday morning's game was a buck fifty and more, buck fifty and higher favorite as of like noon Pacific time on Wednesday afternoon for Thursday morning's game. Yet the comeback on China Trust was anywhere from plus 100 to plus 110. Uh, you don't see 40 to 50 percent lines ever when it comes to dollar forty, dollar fifty, dollar sixty favorites. But that was the case. We cashed an 11-5 win with China Trust and turned a profit for Thursday's baseball. All right, let's get to it. We're six and one with our free picks in Korean baseball. Again, don't forget, I've got a one play in baseball for Friday morning. It's available right now. You can grab it up until about 1 a.m. Eastern time. And uh, it's a total from Friday's card. It is a five-star total. So go grab it if you want to jump on board. Free pick for Friday morning. Games go at 5.30 a.m. Eastern, 2.30 a.m. Pacific. We're looking at the battle between Kaboom and the LG Twins. We're going to back the LJ Twins here. Uh, short dog for the most part. Might have to lay a couple of pennies and a couple of joints. Uh, but as far as these two pitchers are concerned, listen, both were throwing a lot of relief last year. Both uh, debuted this season by starting games. And uh, it was a situation where I think you're going to see that kind of pitcher on the mound again. A guy, in, in, in each case, who's used to throwing out of the pen, who is now becoming a starter. So we might, we might not see these two starters, or at least one of them, for more than five innings in this game. Then it becomes a bullpen game. Then it becomes a, a strategic game in the late innings when it comes to how they're going to handle things at the plate. And I'm going to tell you, that's where LG has the advantage. If you look at Kiwoom, their bottom half in offensive metrics in the league in just about every important metric. Uh, they're ninth in batting average, eighth in OBP and slugging, sixth in run scoring per game. You look at LG, top three in several offensive metrics. Uh, and, and I tell you what, as far as scoring is concerned, again, they're right up there near the top of the, uh, of the heap, averaging about 6.8 runs per game, the LG Twins, so far on the season. So we think we're getting value with LG and we're going to back them on 
Friday morning. Again, that game goes at 5.30 Eastern, 2.30 a.m. Pacific. The LG Twins are free picking Korean baseball on Friday. Don't forget about everything that's going to be going this weekend over at DocSports.com. And again, Friday, 11.30 a.m. Eastern, I will post Saturday morning soccer in German, uh, Bundesliga action, and of course, Belarus. I will have my NASCAR posted on Sunday morning. I'll have my UFC posted on Saturday morning. KBO and Taiwan baseball every day, 3.30 p.m. Eastern. So be sure to check for that. So we might not be getting uh, too many sports yet, North American style, but there's plenty to go around. And now we're getting NASCAR and UFC in the mix up here in the States. So we're very happy about that. All right, it's going to do it for me for Friday. Uh, be sure to check out all the videos this weekend. I will have a UFC video for Saturday. I will have a NASCAR video that I'll post on Saturday for Sunday's race. All right back here along with our KBO videos. I'm Scott Sprites of DocSports.com. If you like the videos, click on that thumbs up button. Be sure to subscribe. Let's put them in the win column right back here Friday night with more action for Saturday's card. We'll talk to you then.